Hello, hi everybody, and welcome to my channel, Home With Me, Mrs. K. If you guys are new here, hi, it's lovely to have you. And if you are one of my usual returning viewers, thank you so much for choosing to watch my video today. As you guys have seen from today's title, I am gonna be showing you what I have got my daughter for her birthday, which for me, it's something I've never done before. It's something I've never brought to my channel, but I thought, why not do something a little bit different and show you guys what I do get and how we celebrate for birthdays um for those of you who are new to my channel so jessica is my youngest of the two and she is going to be turning 12 in just a few days right so i'm going to start with showing you the wrapping paper first so every single year for my kids birthdays since they've been born i have done a theme and my kids really really love it they love waking up on their birthday they love seeing what theme i've done for them and i just think it makes it a lot more fun and a lot more enjoyable they really really love it they really really love to see the theme that i've done and it won't be a surprise to those of you who have followed me for quite some time that i have chosen to do her a disney stitch theme this year because she is just absolutely obsessed with stitch she loves it so much so i was definitely going to do the theme for that this year however i have been really really struggling to find stitch wrapping paper it has been a real struggle i've tried asda i've tried sainsbury's i've tried tesco couldn't find it. So I went into Powland and then they had some plain blue wrapping paper. So I thought, okay, I will get that. At least it's the color of the theme. Maybe I can find some stitch stickers, stick it on the paper to make it look like wrapping paper. Again, I've had a real struggle, couldn't find any stickers. So I've just kind of stuck to the idea of having the plain paper. But then yesterday I went into Primark just to kind of pick up a few bits. And I saw this at the checkout, which is stitch wrapping paper sadly this was the last roll i asked the lady they didn't have any more so i said okay don't worry i'll grab this one i was desperate for it and then i'm just going to now mix it up with the other ones i do need to pop to hobby craft as well to get some ribbon to just kind of make the presents look pretty once they are wrapped up so that is the paper that i have gone for so now let's show you the presents i'm going to start by showing you this one because guys look how cool is this look at the size of this it is absolutely ginormous and i kid you not right for the last year and a half she has been begging us to find her a life-size stitch teddy bear last year we found one on aliexpress and i'm not too keen on ordering from there i've heard a lot of bad things so i thought i'm not going to risk it and it was priced around 70 80 pounds they also had another one which come from china or hong kong again around about the 98 pounds mark and i was just not prepared to pay that i went into smith's the other day and i saw this in there and i thought oh my goodness i don't think i've seen one as big as this here in the UK. I've not seen one. So I had to grab this. And it wasn't priced too bad either, guys. It was priced at 39.99, which I don't think for the size of it and for Disney, it's actually that bad. And even better, there's a button, so it does make noises. <laughs> How good is this, guys? It's just so cool. She is gonna absolutely love this i'm sorry if i am whispering but she's literally just in the next room she has got a tablet on but i'm hoping she can't hear me um and i will pop up this video after her birthday because i just don't trust her to watch the video so yeah she is really going to absolutely go ballistic over this she really really is i'm not going to wrap it up i'm literally just going to stick him amongst her presents and kind of just sat next to her birthday setup but isn't it cool it's just so good anyone else that does love stitch out there this would be a really, really good present idea for birthdays or even a Christmas present. Such a good present idea. Let's show you what's in the bag. I've just got like literally a load of random stuff from all the different shops. I picked this up yesterday in Primark, which I thought was really, really cute because she has been asking me for some hoodies. So I got her this one. This was actually in the adult section, but I think that's going to fit her. It's a size 2X small. And this one was priced at £8, so I think she's going to really, really like that one. Um, I've got two bows here as well, giant bows for her present. So the white one I'm going to put on the stitched teddy bear. And then this one I'm actually going to put on her main present, which I will show you guys in a few seconds. This I got her as well. She's kind of slowly, very slowly going out with her like toys and stuff like that. But she did say that she really, really wanted the football barbie doll she wants it just to kind of display in her room next to her pink 
football stuff that she has got. So I did get that, which came from Argos, priced at fourteen ninety nine. So I thought, yeah, I'd grab her that. These little toy bits I got as well from a toy shop. Let me show these to you. She's asked for some slimy bits as well. So this, I grabbed her, which was priced at $2.99 for this really big tub of slime. It's like galaxy slime, all different colours, which I thought was really, really cool. I got her this really, really cute squishy toy. She loves these, really, really loves them. She's got them all around her bedroom. This one was priced at $2.99 as well. And then I got her some new skincare items. She's been asking for some new skincare. For Christmas, I got her the Bubble brand. But this year I thought I would go for this one. It's quite popular. I've seen it all over TikTok. A lot of the younger girls like to use it. I was in boots for quite some time actually reading all of the back of this and making sure that there's nothing too harsh in there for her skin. I do like to be careful. I don't really like to get anything that's got any like hyaluronic stuff in it or linalol because I know that can be quite, um, what's the word, like an allergic one to kind of not really use. So yeah, I took some time going through all of these to make sure I could grab her the safest one. So this is a creamy jelly cleanser and this one was priced at 9.99 and then I also got her the lip oil as well which was also priced at 9.99. Um then I went into HM. She is going to absolutely love these. She loves anything to do with like the San Rio stuff. Um, Karomi, um, what's the other one, Hello Kitty, she loves all of that stuff and I was so over the moon when I saw these in H&M. So this is the cinnamon roll one which is one of her absolute favourites. This is a size 10 to 12 um, in years and it was priced at 7 99 which is just so cute, she's going to like that so much. And then I also got her the pink one which is the Karomi one and again this was priced at 7 99 and again the same age which is 10 to 12 years so that's those two i think i have got some other bits from h&m as well but they're kind of randomly all over the place so let me go into these boxes and show you what is in here i have got scissors to open this if you needed there we go i actually ordered this a few months ago so i've had this for quite some time this was quite expensive it's the stitch Lego. She saw this a couple of weeks back when we went shopping and no, a couple of months back, sorry. And she really, really wanted it. I said, okay, maybe for your birthday. It was quite expensive. It was priced around 60 pound, but I know she's gonna absolutely love this. So I got her that. Let me just hide this box over here. And then I've also got another stitch related present in here. I think I'm gonna need the scissors for this one, guys. Let's open that. So here it is, and again it's the stitch, how cool is this? We love Monopoly in this house, it's one of our favourite games, we always play it. We've got about 10 I think, different various kind of board games of it, so she is going to absolutely freak out when she sees that they have a stitch one, because I don't even think she knows that the stitch Monopoly even exists, so she's going to really really freak out about that one. Um, this is her main birthday present, so let me just show it to you. So, I have got her a new Apple phone. She has got a phone, but it's seen better days. She's had it for quite a long time. I think she's had it for around six, seven years. It's not the best phone. It's starting to wear down. It's running really, really slow. She can't hear her friends when she's on a call. And it's just becoming really, really stressful for her because she just can't use it for what she needs to use it for. So I said to Simon, we'll get her a new phone. This one also has calls and texts on it because the other one doesn't. And now she's in high school, I would like her to, you know, to be able to text me or call me if she needs me. Whereas at the moment she can't do that with the phone that she's got. So we got her the um, iPhone 12 in the purple shade. So she is really going to love this so much. So yeah, that is her main present. I like to get my kids a main present and then do like other little bits and pieces as well. Oh, this I got her, which was really, really cute. I found this in Asda, which I thought was so adorable. I might have shown this to you guys on a previous um, 
pull so it's a stationary fridge which is just so adorable they've got really really cute little stationary bits in there you've got miniature notepads then you've got food and drink which is like your pens and your highlighters and stuff like that have a look at that up close it's just so adorable you guys can see as well at the back there You've got a little bottle of drink, which is a rubber, and you've got a little can of drink in the fridge, which is your sharpener. It's just honestly the cutest little stationary gift ever. And that's gonna look really, really cute in her bedroom. And that was £12.50. Now these, she has been asking me for these last Christmas. And I honestly felt like the worst mum in the world because she was really desperate for these. It was the one thing that she really asked for. And at that time, they just didn't have them in kid sizes. They only had them for grown-ups. So I was very excited to finally be able to grab her a pair of these in the kid sizes. Got them from Team U. I think they were priced at £9.99. Um, and they're kind of like, they're supposed to be like Nike replica trainer slippers. But she has been desperate for these. She is going to absolutely go insane when she does see these. I'm going to try and get a video get her reactions and see if she's okay with me posting it online because my kids are very I don't know they don't really like to post themselves online so I do have to respect their privacy but I'll see if I can kind of get a few little snippets of her reaction but yes she is going to love these so much I literally can't like, see her face in the morning oh this I got which is a party cannon for her birthday morning I will explain what our kind of birthday days look like once I am wrapping up the presents and explain to you guys what it is that we do do I've got these stitch gift bags as well just to put the clothes in rather than wrap them up I'm just going to put these in these bags I got these from Primark and they were priced at 90 pence each and I've got four of those and um, oh I've got some more clothes from H&M here oh stitch balloon in there two stitch balloons actually i've got her these tops which i just know she is going to love these so much she loves t-shirts like these she absolutely loves them this one was priced at 5.99 and again it's in the age 10 to 12 years and then it has the number six on the back and then this one as well to go with it in the same color which i thought was just so cute isn't that a nice color really really lovely color how much did i pay for that one 2.99 for that one which is a really really good price let me stick those back in there for now i'm getting a little bit buried now on the table um these as well she wanted some nike socks as well for her to wear to school for pe so i picked those up for her from sports direct very pricey i have to say 14.99 for three pairs of socks I was not happy about buying that, but it's something that she really, really wanted. So as it's her birthday, I said I would get it as a treat. This as well, I think she's going to really like. Most of the stuff here, she has no idea that I've got. I pretty much picked everything myself. Apart from her asking for the slippers, she asked for the Lego and she asked for the socks. Anything else I've kind of just randomly got on my own. So it's literally going to be such a surprise to her in the morning. Um, I got her a pink football kit which I know she is just going to freak out about so they're the shorts and it's got the number 12 on it and then this is the top and then on the back which I just love so much I have personalized it so I've put Jess on the back and then the number 12 which is just so cool I didn't know this but um my son Jake told me that this is actually the football kit that Messi plays for like the team that they pay for which is just like oh my gosh she's gonna love that even more because she loves him so yeah she's gonna really like this really really like it it's just so cool i have um oh that reminds me i have ordered some like pink footbally stuff like shin pads and a whistle and a captain's bag but it's not here yet so i'm waiting for that to arrive and then you also get some black football socks in there as well i actually purchased this from amazon and i think it was about 20 quid for the set which isn't really that bad just before i forget whilst i am on that subject i need to grab something out of the cupboard to show you guys right i'm back so this i got as well which is a pink nike football which is going to go really really well with the football kit picked this up from sports direct and i think this was priced at 14.99 which is going to really really like that i also got another squish mellow teddy bear for her she hasn't got like a halloween one so i thought i'd grab that one for her which i picked up in the card factory for just 8.99 um these as well i got her she has been asking 
for these. She has them in the black colour. So these are the night trainers. She has them in black. She really, really wanted them in the pale blue colour. I went to get the pale blue colour and they said that they're apparently now out of season. They don't do them anymore. Try another sports shop. So I went to another JD sports shop. Again, they said they don't do the pale blue in the shops anymore. Maybe you can order them, but they're not going to get here in time. But they do have a new colour out for the season. Not sure how she's going to react to that, but she does love pink. So I'm hoping that she really, really loves these. I really hope so. If not, I have kept the receipt and if she doesn't like the colour, which I think she is going to because she really, really loves pink, then I will try and get the lighter blue ones online. If she does love the colour, I'm probably going to try and get the blue ones for Christmas. But I, I don't know. I think she's going to really like these. I really, really do think she's going to like them. So yeah, that's them. How much were they? They were priced at 60 quid, 60 pound for those. They have got her this really cute little bracelet with her name on, which I got from Peacocks. That was priced at five pounds. I also got her a Stitch Primark gift card for her to go shopping if she wants to. And I have stuck 20 quid on there. This I got in next, which is a navy blue gap t-shirt how much was this priced i think this was 11 quid yeah 11 pounds for that one so that's that oh these are really cute i actually got these from shein have a look at these they're so cute the cutest pajamas ever look at those really nice blue color so they're the shorts and then this is the best top to go with it really really cute and i think these were priced at around three quid something like that yeah, she does love bits like that. Let me just pop this down here for a quick second. This I got from B&M. It's a iPhone charging wire, which she really, really needs. This was priced at six quid. Then I got her this cute little carpet, which is actually gonna go in her bedroom. If you guys can see that, is it the right way up? Yeah. It says, you're like really pretty, which is a really, really famous quote from the Mean Girls movie. And I think this was priced at around £2 something. It was really, really cheap. So I've got that to go in her bedroom. And then to go with that, I also got this sign, which some of you guys have seen before, but I've had this for quite some time. It's to go with the carpet. And it pretty much says what the rug says, really. It says, you're like really pretty. And then when you plug it in, it's a really, really lovely, bright pink colour. So I know she's going to really, really love this. And it's going to go really nicely in her new bedroom, above her new bed. I think it's nice when you get them like little cute girly things for their bedroom. And she really, really likes girly stuff like this. She really, really does. This was priced at just over a tenner, I believe, from Team Lou. Um, this I grabbed in Primark as well, which is a sheer lip gloss. That was priced at £3.50 and there's like a moisturising one as well. Um, then I have got her some new phone cases for her phone. Let me just show you guys those. This is the beige one with the black hearts. Also got her this really, really lovely wiggly kind of aqua blue one. And then I've got her this black one with like cat ears at the top. I think she's going to really like that one actually. And then this one I got her to use for Halloween. These phone cases were all priced at 99 pence or just under. Also got her this birthday card, which is going to be from Jape. We have got a stitch one, which I have already wrote out. I also got her these stitch top trump cards, which was priced at £8 from Asda. And then I also got her this curl club hairspray this can be quite expensive actually but i found it in home bargains for just two pound fifty so i think this is around five plus in super drug and everything like that she does love to do her hair and kind of scrunch it up and make it a little bit curly so i've just got her that um for something extra All right now let me go into this bag which is my last bag of goodies this is brand new in home bargains it's the nano craft which is very popular on tiktok you would not believe this. I'm sure this was around $4.99 in Home Bargains. We was in a toy shop yesterday and I showed Simon it. They had this price at $14.99. £15 and it's only a fiver, I think, or just under a five quid in Home Bargains. It's like a squishy ball. Like you make your own 
squishy balls, if you guys can see back there, which she's going to really, really love. Oh, oh this looks so cute. Where did I find this? B&M. Look at this. It's like a mini bag of Cheeto puffs. And then you can open the top of the bag and you can take out the individual little cheese puff teddies. Oh, I just thought that was so adorable. Priced at three quid. Oh, this is cool as well. I've got this candle, a bit random, but I got it from Sainsbury's. It says Slay Queen on it. It's just something that her and her friends love to say. So I saw this and I thought that was absolutely hilarious. It smells really, really nice too. And again, I thought she could use that in her new bedroom. I'm not going to let her light the candle because at the moment she's too young. She's too irresponsible. She's very ditzy like me. She likes to dance. She likes to spin around. I've just got terrible visions of her spinning around with her dressing gown on, catching the flame of light and then catching herself to light. So at the moment, she's just going to use this for decoration until she does get a little bit more older. <laughs> and I don't have to worry, she's going to set herself on fire. Oh, these I got, which I got from Timu. She loves these. She's got a pink pair of Hello Kitty pyjamas at the moment. Again, really, really popular with the kids at the moment. These were priced at £7. And these are the Halloween ones. And these are in a size six so yeah i've got those i'm like burying myself alive guys i've got another squidgy toy here this one was from b m priced at three pounds which i think is a really good price for that actually it's quite a nice size isn't it this was also from b m guys priced at 19.99 it is a stitch mystery capsules and there's like all mystery things inside it says there's nine surprises inside so no idea what's in there but i thought that'd be really really cool and then once she has opened it she can keep the stitch head for decoration in her bedroom and she can also store bits and pieces in there this i got as well which is a stitch football iron on transfer so it goes on a t-shirt i do need to get a t-shirt actually and then iron that on that came from team i think that was priced at around one pound or something um what's in here guys this is from amazon i think oh stylist pen so it's for her ipad she likes to do drawing and stuff on her ipad and she's forever nicking her brother's pen so i got her own one he's got a black one so i thought i would get her the white color one let's see if i can take that to show it to you that way if she has a different color she can't nick his pen so that is that one you can get the apple ones but they are really expensive they're around 99 pounds but i just got this one for about 11 quid jake's got the same one and it works really really well with the ipads so yeah i've got her that uh, i also got her this as well which is gonna go with her ipad i think she's gonna really really love this again they have an apple version but it was priced at a hundred and something pounds which i just thought is a bit much so it comes in this really, really lovely pale pink case. And if I just open it up to show you guys, it's actually a keyboard as well. So you've got the case, which I think is really, really good. So your iPad goes in here and then you can click the keypad to the iPad just by Bluetooth, I think, which I thought this was going to be so handy, especially when she uses her iPad to do her homework she can now type away and use that and i just thought it's a really really lovely gift and really nice to go with the pen as well and i love that you get a case with it as well which is really really good and that was priced at 19.99 i think which compared to the apple one is a massive saving um right i've got a couple more bits left guys and then that is it this she has been asking me for which is a p louise bad I don't know if I can say the word, I don't want to get blocked, B-I-T-C-H, which is like a, for those who don't know who P. Louise is, she's like a very big makeup brand company. They do really, really cute kind of makeup-y stuff. And this is like a carton of juice. It's like a real cute carton. It has a straw. And then inside you get um, lip glosses and stuff. This should have been 19.99 on the P. Louise website, but I actually got this from TikTok shop very surprised i paid 9.99 for that and it came the very next day and i didn't even have to pay for delivery so yeah very very impressed with that i can't open it because once i open it the box has been ruined but hopefully once she has opened these i can then try and pop up some pictures and stuff um on here um 
And then, yeah, I think that's it for the present wires. Just got a pack of blue and white balloons just to stick up. Oh yeah, here's the here's the stitch card that I have already wrote out. I've got a blue happy birthday banner as well from Asda. And then this I have got for her birthday cake. I was trying to find a stitch birthday cake, but Jessica doesn't like a Victoria cake. She doesn't like the birthday cake. The only cake she will eat is chocolate. So I have got her a plain chocolate cake and then I have had this made to go on the top of her cake. Can you see that? Isn't it really, really cute? I do get a little stick in here as well to pop it onto the cake. I'm gonna put that back in here so it doesn't get ruined. And then to go on the cake as well, just because I thought it's gonna be a little bit plain, just chocolate cake and just that topper, I thought I would get these little sponge footballs which were in Asda and I'm just gonna stick them one on the top and then a couple around the bottom of the cake just to kind of make it look a bit more you know, footbally. Um, yeah, that's all of the gifts that I had to show you. I think she's got two or three more that are coming on the way that I just haven't been able to show you guys today. So apologies for that. Now I need to get wrapping um, and then, yeah, after I've wrapped everything, go and get the ribbon from the shop, put all the ribbons on and then, yeah, get all of the birthday prep and stuff done, which you guys will see towards the end of the video right let's get wrapping and let's get tidying because i'm kind of like burying myself alive here <laughs> right let's get going so here is the birthday setup guys what do you think i absolutely love it and i had the most funnest time putting this together i really really did and i really loved how i put all of the balloons onto the bookcase i just thought that was so different and it just looked really really lovely she was so happy when she saw this in the morning her face was literally a picture and yeah i just had so much fun doing it the presents i wrapped all of them up managed to get the ribbon that i needed from hobby craft and yeah i just had a really really fun time and putting this together another thing i love to do is when i'm doing the birthday setups i love to go on youtube and search for birthday backgrounds and that's what that was on the tv um so yeah thank you guys for watching this video and i will see you in the next one